Hello guys, um, it has been a while since I've made a video like this, um, it's very nice to get to speak to you without a game or a skit as a prerequisite. Today's topic is something that most of y'all with eyes to see and ears to hear have probably already heard about already. Uh, the Grammys just took place a few days ago, and um, if you've seen anything from it, you know that there was a lot of demonic stuff, you know, like demonic ritualistic stuff on stage uh, with everyone watching, and, uh, you know, people have been wearing red and devil horns and just celebrating evil like that. Uh, Chandler Moore... Uh, attended the Grammys and walked the red carpet uh, with his wife, who was wearing something very immodest, a very immodest dress. Um, I saw it and it made me like wonder if she just went into like Kim Kardashian's closet um, and found something to wear. Um, it, it it definitely was not the uh, attire that um a worship's you know a worship leader's lot a worship leader's wife sorry um should be wearing in front of the whole world um chandler moore and his wife have a history of demonstrating lewd inappropriate behavior um in one of his wedding photos um it showed his wife kind of bending, you know, in kind of a suggestive, really suggestive way. If you've, uh, if you've seen it, you, you know what I'm talking about. Um, when I first heard people um, talking about the wedding photo, I, you know, I, I was, my first idea was, you know, maybe they're overreacting, uh, being a little legalistic. You know, and, and, and then I saw the photo, and I was like, wow, okay, I, um, I see where these people are coming from. He later apologized about the photo, and, um, for that reason, I was a little, you know, on the fence about mentioning it. Because, you know, I really don't believe in holding people's pasts against them. But he hasn't improved his behavior and he doesn't really seem sorry. Um, he hasn't really learned his lesson at all, is uh, the point I'm trying to make. He seems sorry that he got in trouble, is really what I took away from, from that. He, t he, um, he won an award at the Grammys and, uh, he seemed to kind of just be completely oblivious to all the demonic stuff. He, he kind of seemed to take all the demonic stuff in stride. If it was me in that situation, I think I would have just gone up there, accepted the award and, um, just started calling everyone out and preaching, but, um, yeah, it, it really disgusts me that he just kind of brushed all that off. He didn't seem bothered at all by the devil worship that was happening in front of him. Um, I felt the Holy Spirit come upon me when I was considering all of this, and I really wanted to uh, call out all of the apathy and the ambivalence that these mainstream worship leaders and church leaders are showing. God is going to humble all of these people and lower the high places. He is going to raise up real men of God. 